So I know I said I wouldn't try Arizona Sunshine, but I have few problems with the, with like overall everything. It's kind of like so basically like uh, I normally say that I don't watch anything like any gameplay video and like review whatever because that way I can be like unbiased or whatever I can be. <laughs> uh, but like. Oculus uh, was uh, like throwing in everyone's face the trailer gameplay and then like trailer gameplay. <laughs> it's kind of like basically one or two hours before the official Arizona Sunshine release day. Uh, so it's kind of like it was hard to not see anything. Uh, my problem with this is that o official Oculus... Uh, channel uploaded the gameplay of this game and it literally like looks like a potato that's what i i was see it's really bad You know what's funny? Now uh, I see that uh, because you know, as a crea VR creator content, I know how to edit uh, VR uh, videos. <laughs> Even from the official Oculus channel, they did not notice that there is a audio uh, desync on every um, recorded video on the headset. So they didn't fix it even in the video. See. Yeah, you can like see, like hear the sh uh, gunshots like a little bit after the actual gunshot. <laughs> okay, that's a huge prof professionalism. Anyways, like, I it's hard to believe that uh, they ported Arizona to Quest in s a such state like that, graphic wise, because. This is Vertigo games we were talking about. They released uh, Red Matter on Quest also, which is like one of the best looking uh, games uh, on the Quest. So, like, now they are competing for the worst, worst looking game on Quest. <laughs> I'm not sure if they are, just want to go for the record or whatever, but I, I can't, it's hard to believe it. it's actually like that. So, I want to give the game a fair shot because that's. Like, every game deserves that, right? Uh, like, if you won't ever play the game, you will uh, never know. And from assuming things, I guess it's a little bit wrong to do that. <sighs> but, so, yeah. Let's just go this game. I hope I'm wrong, because uh, people apparently love this game from the reviews overall. And, uh, you know, I've never played the like Rift version, so I'm not sure what I should expect, but I know that this game is old, I know this is a port, and not everything was ported over, because uh, in the future months there will be like uh, additional DLC packs, stuff like that, some free, some not, some not, I had an issue with that also, but whatever, we, let's just see if actually the game is fine or not. <laughs> Because this is Vertigo, so... Like, it just couldn't be not right. I don't know. Watch to access the menu. Okay, well... Okay. I didn't push anything. <laughs> How it was calibrated then? <laughs> Wait. No, 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 no. <laughs> uh, give me... Yeah, again calibration, I guess. Wait. I... I want to pick it up. Okay. It's a little bit... Clunky. Like, like that, you can't grab, you can grab only when the circle lights up. Weird, okay. 
Uh, and you can't really like insert. Wait. What? Okay. Okay. Again, calibration. I hope there's smooth uh, uh, locomotion done because that would be a weird excuse. Move hands to waist. Press trigger. I didn't push the button! Okay. <laughs> I hope it's, uh, it's not big a deal. So... Like... Subtitles, obviously. Analy analytics? Okay. Um, movement. Walking. Yeah. Forward direction. Head. Rotation. Smooth. Rotation speed. Yeah, that's fine. Left-handed allows striking. Okay, we're Gucci. I mean, at least uh, this works. So, credits. Move to mouth to heal. Okay, that's not that bad. Graphics-wise, um, it's a little bit better than I saw on the actual video that Oculus released. But just a little bit, not a huge amount. I mean, obviously we know that uh, in the headset I see a little bit differently than on the actual video. On the Quest videos, on the, Rift, on the Link videos it, everything's fine, so... But I don't want to play uh, single player because I don't think that would be fun or whatever. I actually want to see the campaign in multiplayer. What? Okay. No matches have been found. Ah, oh, come on. I mean, no one's playing, so that's this is just that it. So I guess we will see a little bit of the campaign and ho and then horde mode, or maybe let's see if anyone is in horde mode. No one's playing. Who are people? <laughs> I mean, you know, the community is mostly American-based, so now they are pretty much waking up, going to work. So I'm like forced to do the single campaign. Mode apocalyptic story normal difficulty. Yeah, give me normal like I don't think I will. Other oh, stages. Okay. I heard the game playing time is like two hours. Ah, because okay. This I saw some of these stages from the trailer actually. Okay. So I guess let's see this first uh, stage. I mean... Oh! Whoa! Oh, it's him, not a zombie! Never thought I'd miss my alarm clock. Okay. Uh... Shit, it's clunky, like... It's like hard controlled. I did this to the menu. Okay, this is. Ah, it's like the communication. Okay, I mean, yeah, sure. Look. What the hell? Oh, whoa. Good morning there, ugly. <clears throat> well, alright. I guess I'll uh, do no. the nice thing here, Fred. Put you out of your misery. Oh. Um. Where is my gun? Locked and loaded. This is it. Damn. Well, hey, I'm sorry things didn't work out between us, buddy. But, uh, I'm out of here. What, what can I say? Okay, I mean, if you're looking at the environment, it's pretty much the wizard's graphics. The things that you can interact with, however, are 
fine. They're not crazily bad. They're okay. At least in my eyes, I guess. So... It doesn't seem uh, oh, too shit. bad. At least for Damn, now. Damn, Freddy. Got you good, didn't I? Oh, gotta get going, buddy. Start the day. Hey, break a leg, ugly. Okay. Now White has no ammo. I just switch hands. So, I will die then? <laughs> okay. I mean, sure. Ooh, my ammo belt. Hello. Hope it still fits. I'm on a strip. Ooh. Still got some ammunition left too. Let's stock this baby up. Okay, that's pretty easy to handle. Eject empty magazine. Move ammo to both. Yeah, alright. Time okay. for some target practice. That's a pretty cool reloading mechanic. Oh shit. Okay, that's fine. How do I know that I will even shoot it? Like Ah, ah, because here is aim. Okay, yeah, that works. Actually. Surprisingly, it's pretty good aim. What the hell is happening here? Ah, there you guys are. I was starting to get a little lonely. What the so what's up, dudes? You know the rules though. Don't get too close. Don't get too close. Guys, what did I just say? Don't get too close. Okay. I mean... It's not that bad, actually. Like... It, I think it could be way worse. I mean, the graphics are here, especially like, atrocious, but... I think it could be worse, I don't know. Hard to tell. You happy now? Didn't have At to least go for down now. like this, you know. You could have sat down, had a nice cup of coffee, talked it through, but no. <laughs> okay. Well, I guess we're done here. Let's head out to that bridge I saw downstream yesterday. I really like the reloading mechanic. Oh shit, they crawl. Ah, uh, goddammit. What the hell happened here? How? Okay. <laughs> but the models are bad also, like... <laughs> God damn! This knee looks like Lara Croft's tits from the PlayStation. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. No climbing then. <laughs> Why it's loading? <laughs> like it was just like maybe five minutes of gameplay. <laughs> or is it the next stage? Well, I don't know. <laughs> what? Yeah, this is pretty much next stage. That was a little bit fast. Uh so damn hot. And Freddy over here trying to get a tan. Hey, Freddy, come on. Who's Freddy? <laughs> oh, 
What the hell? What the hell do you have here? Ew. Uh, press to... What? Holster? Holster. Oh, okay. If I have like different weapon or something. I don't know. Ew! <laughs> Good. Damn it! All right. Think, think, think. I need to find another radio. I wonder if I can like just I gotta get to the source smash a zombie with that. That would be, I guess, fine. Hmm. Um. <laughs> no, it doesn't work. No interaction with objects, come on. <laughs> That's a little bit... At least, I mean bad, kinda. From a game design perspective. I mean... Is it fair to say that the models look worse than the wizard? <laughs> That's actually saying a lot, <laughs> because I clearly remember that, <laughs> how it actually looked. Why are you running? Jesus. Okay, well. I'm taking ammo. Don't touch me. Something here. Oh, a pistol. Boom! Check you out. You'll serve me well, my friend. Nice. I guess this is stronger or something. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> oh. You can clearly tell that this is a really old game. I mean, really. Only like four years or something, but like still in VR years that's kinda a lot <laughs> I should tend though right that yeah you old Dutchman huh For me I would love to visit Amsterdam someday just relaxing I got hey. all these cars Looks like they all went running from a horde. Horde? They just randomly spawned there. Come on. Oh. Some action? Oh. Speaking of the bastards. Not really challenging. I'm playing. I know I'm playing on normal, but still, it's just a matter of not forgetting to reload, basically. Whew. That took quite a bit of ammo. Let's see if I not can really. find some more in these cars. 
What the hell was that? <laughs> he just went from under the... Not car, but like, ground. I'm a, I'm a. It's stuttering for some reason when I'm turning now. Something is wrong. Like, I don't know if it's lagging or something, but okay. Them. I feel like it will crash on me or something. Okay, let's just go. We have like, I guess enough ammo. But I think it's the next area now. Safe haven at the refinery. No. Alright. They're probably the ones broadcasting that radio signal. Things Sorry, randomly appearing. Friends. Maybe I can get around here. Oh, okay. I like the aim. It's very true to the how you kind of shoot an actual pistol. I don't know how to shoot with a left hand though. I mean, I'm fine, kinda, but don't run. What the hell is that <laughs> M maneuver? You will not even turn? Come on. What the hell was that? The car belongs to the old Dutchman mine. Bet it has some useful stuff. Let's check it out. Which one? This one? <laughs> it's okay. locked. Alright, I'm gonna need the key. It might be in the ticket office. Is this ticket office? What's happening upstairs? <laughs> I mean, there is no other choice to just go with the door, right? Nice. What are you doing there? Shut up! <laughs> Is this a boss or something? He's not dying. God damn it. <laughs> I have no ammo so I can't like risk it that. They're just marching upstairs. Come on. I hear footsteps everywhere, that's not fun. <laughs> Actually, let's go to the corner. I don't know. Shush! <laughs> what was that dodge though? Okay. What? Locked? Uh, 
I'm not sure. Weird. Oh, okay. No, no, no. Not with me. Hello, hello. <laughs> that big. Oh. Oh. That seems fun. That's just to outside, right? Yeah. Is there something there? Wait. Oh, that's another room? Okay, uh, key. Okay, well that was fine. <laughs> oh, I can sprint. Okay, well, <laughs> good to know now. <laughs> yes, it still works. Let's check it out. Oh, a winch, huh? <gasps> Look at this. That'll come in handy. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Turn it off, turn it off. Fuck, here they come. <laughs> Oh! Ooh! Hey! No, 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 don't wait. Don't go like that. You're dead? Good. What's that? Oh, ammo. Wait, man. Don't run on the corridors. No, no, no. <laughs> Helmet. <laughs> What is she carrying? An armor? <laughs> what is this? Oh shit! No no no! This bitch is coming from behind! <laughs> And <laughs> he's even crawling to me. Just die. <laughs> the models are pretty funny though. It re kind of reminds me... I mean, not really. Damn. But the House of the Dead. <laughs> that was a close call. <sighs> okay, we'll cross that and maybe we'll finish or something. I mean, we went to the other location, but there was no lo loading screen again, so just I think you're dead, right? Okay, there's still much ammo. Left. From behind? Oh shit. Okay. 
Hmm. Okay. Shit, man. That oh. line better be close. Probably this one is uh, way too hot out another here. location. Yeah? Yeah, okay. Um <coughs> loading logging and it's just another ah oh, <laughs> this is actually the place of the actual Hello? gameplay trailer Any that uh, Oculus released but like oh, comparing actually, what I see it's not actually that somewhere. bad like really on their video it looks like a total potato Okay, but there's no point to, of me playing uh, more than than that, though. Okay, let's go to the menu. Uh, okay, I mean, I was pretty much in a mood to just like shit on this game today. Pretty much, because my day went a little bit rocky. <laughs> Let's just say that, uh, in work. Uh, but it's... okay. So if we're talking about the price, there's no fucking way this uh, game should be 40 euro. I've not played multiplayer yet, but I can already see the multiplayer, especially the co-op in the campaign would be really, really fun to play with someone. Straight up, like there's no question about it. Uh, horde mode, I assume it's kind of like waves of zombies, so it makes sense also. Um, I, from a zombie games, I played Death Horizon, which was more, uh, I would say, immersive. Like, uh, you actually was scared for your life and stuff like that, because you, you didn't expect anything to happen, and suddenly there's a jump scare, or like there's just like some dogs. Uh, in Original Sunshine, I think it's more about the actual shooting uh, zombies and killing them, rather than just being scared. I don't feel like this is like a pure horror game. I would say it's just like an arcade in a horror style. Uh, but like it, this game should be like, I guess at maximum 30 euro. Um, so it should be cheaper. <laughs> like there's no just like ex um, excuse about it. And I think I know why they made it pricier because uh, like in the next months, uh, there would be DLCs that w was like, I think you had to pay in the Rift version. I'm not sure, but I'm assuming. Um, but like you, like people that bought Arizona Sunshine on the quest, you few of the first DLCs they will get for free and the rest just normally. Um, so I think what they thought would be a good idea is to rise up the price that was on the Rift Store. I think on the Rift Store it was like 30 euro for the Rift version. Here's 40. Um, it's kind of like they assumed they packed the future DLCs in the price that you pay or uh, now, assuming you will play in the future kind of those DLCs to get your money worth you know what i mean it's kind of like i it's a little bit weird tactic i think that's what they assumed it would be a good idea i think i don't know that's what i kind of like <laughs> see um so it's kind of like if you buy it now you don't you want get your own money worth now, but you will get eventually maybe in the next months. But that's a little bit weird tactic to me though, so I don't know. Um, I don't... <laughs> this game is obviously not all, all about graphics, like there's no way. <laughs> there's just no way. I would say it's more about the arcade aspect of this game, to just like run around and just kill zombies. That's pretty much it. Yeah. Like, uh, you can kinda, um, I guess, forgive the graphics, but at the same time, like, if we are pretty much over half year, 
into the quest game. <laughs> um, so I don't think it's a good excuse to just put out something like... I, know, I wouldn't say unpolished, but I would say kind of like it was just thrown together like that. Oh, not really like... Mm, a really exciting release. Like completely. I don't think it's like a full... Uh, good game. And I read it on the Reddit that the people had many issues with the multiplayer stuff, there was crashes, like issues with audio, stuff like that. So there are even bugs, so I don't know, like... I guess if people can forgive that, then sure. Apparently this game has like a huge... Uh, um, community around it. I mean, makes sense because back in the day it was pretty much the biggest game when I think the original, I think maybe CV1 or DK2, I'm not really sure, I have n no idea about Oculus history. Uh, so this game was like a really big back in the day, so it still has a dedicated community around it. So I guess it's good for them, <laughs> like, sure. Whatever. Um, I don't think it's worth to do the whole preview of that. I mean, there's nothing much more to this game than just shooting zombies and just uh, like pass levels, pretty much. I don't think, I mean, <laughs> I've not played multiplayer. If I would get this game, which I wouldn't, <laughs> but like if people other would, I would get this game purely for a multiplayer player. I guess that's just that. For an arcade game. But not for the campaign. Uh, but at the same time, the narration was, I mean, kind of cute. Kind of funny, kind of. So it was like not boring and it was not like bland like in other games to just like throw it, throw the story, that's it. I mean, no story. Just the narration was okay, I think, I guess. And um, yeah, pretty much this game, pretty much for multiplayer, I can say that. Other than that, uh, I think if there would be in the next ma month's DLCs and some more stuff to, uh, to do, like new modes, I guess, new weapons, like, I don't know, whatever they plan, uh, it would be... I guess more exciting to play it. Uh, but like, you know, the quest development is so fast that there are games that just like up one at each another, so there will be way better games releasing soon anyways. So, uh, yeah, I mean, sure, just average. <laughs> and that's pretty much it, yeah.